みなさんこんにちは。My name is Yuki.I'm Japanese and now live in Japan.This channel is for Japanese learners or people who are interested in Japan.In this channel, I will introduce an interesting Japan in English and Japanese.First, I talk in English and then switch to Japanese. The same content. You can learn about Japanese culture, history, trends, and more. And also, you can try to improve your Japanese listening skills through each video. So, move on to today's topic Mount Fuji. Mount Fuji is the highest. And most famous mountain in Japan. It is located between Yamanashi and Shizuoka prefectures, which is almost in the center of Japan, and the height is 3,776 meters. Mount Fuji is an active volcano and has erupted many times in the past. Most recently, In 707, a large eruption occurred during the Edo period, and it is recorded that there was a great deal of damage. It has erupted for more than 300 years, and it could erupt at any time. If it erupts now, it is said that there will be effects such as volcanic ash. Falling even Tokyo, which is more than 100 kilometers away from Mount Fuji. Since it is a beautiful triangular mountain, it has long been used in painting and visually subjects. The most famous painting is 36 views of Mount Fuji, drawn by a painter, Katsushika Hokusai. In addition, Yokoyama Taikan's Mount, Pain- Mount Fuji painting is also very famous. If you have a Japanese thousand yen bill now, please turn it over. You can see the picture of Mount Fuji. In 2013, Mount Fuji was registered as a UNESCO World Cultural Heritage Site. It was recognized as a universal, universal value that greatly influenced works of art and had meaning as a symbol of Japanese culture. There are five lakes created by past eruptions around Mount Fuji, and they are collectively called the Fuji Five Lakes. These are Lake Motosuko, Lake Shoujiko, Lake Saiko, Lake Kawaguchiko, and Lake Yamanakako. Since the upside down Mount Fuji reflected in the lake looks so beautiful, there are many sightseeing spots and campsites around the Mount Fuji Five Lakes. You can see Mount Fuji from Tokyo, and the place where you can see Mount Fuji are named Fujimi Town. Fujimi Slope and Fujimi Bridge. There are so many place na- names in Japan called Fujimi Blabla. Mount Fuji has so many fascinations that I can't talk about it all at once. I like to introduce it in another video, so please look forward to it. That's all. Then I'll switch to the Japanese part. 富士山は日本で一番高く一番有名な山です。日本のほぼ中心の山梨県と静岡県の間にあり、高さは3776メートルです。富士山は活火山で過去に何度も噴火しています。一番最近は1707年。江戸時代に大噴火が起きていて
とても大きな被害があったと記録されていますその後300年以上噴火しておらずいつ噴火してもおかしくありませんもし今噴火したら富士山から1 0 0メートル以上離れた東京でも火山灰が降るなどの影響があると言われています富士山は美しい三角形の山なので昔から絵や文学の題材に用いられてきました最も有名な絵画は葛飾北斎という画家が描いた「富岳三十六景」ですその他にも横山大観の「富士山絵」もとても有名ですもし今手元に日本の千円札を持っていたらぜひ裏返してみてください富士山の絵を見ることができると思います2013年に富士山はユネスコの世界文化遺産に登録されました絵画などの芸術作品に大きな影響を与えただけでなく日本の文化の象徴としての意味を持っていることが普遍的価値として認められました富士山の周りには過去の噴火でできた湖が5つありそれらをまとめて「富士五湖」と言います「元栖湖」「庄司湖」「西湖」「川口湖」山中湖の5つです湖に映る逆さの富士山がきれいに見えるので富士五湖の周りには観光地やキャンプ場が多くあります東京からも富士山を見ることができ富士山が見られる場所には富士見町富士見坂富士見橋といいった地名が付けられています「富士見まるという地名は日本にとてもたくさんあります富士山には一回では語り尽くせないほどたくさんの魅力がありますまた別の動画でも紹介したいと思うので楽しみにしていてくださいね That's all Can you enjoy it? For beginners, there is also a slow Japanese video, so please check it out. If you have any questions or some topics you want to pick up, please leave me a message in the comment. Thank you for watching. Please thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Ciao, またね